today we came to explore this place, which is called Pedo Lake. And this place was actually closed for several months, might be actually more than that, because the Park of Canada shut it down to make that nice little overlook over there and then they refurbished a lot of the infrastructure here a lot of people enjoying it we came down below the boulders to try to actually get a better shot without a bunch of people and this is also a very nice look at on this side here people really enjoy the colors inside of Peto Lake and especially Peto Lake has something kind of special which is this is kind of like the divide. All of this water here, it actually starts to flow north. So you can see me behind me, way far away at the other end of the lake, there's a little creek that goes down and that flows into the North Saskatchewan River and into Abraham Lake and goes that way. But everything that's south of me here, it actually goes into the Bow Valley, which flows into the Bow River. So this is kind of like the divide for the rivers here, which is quite nice. You can see behind me there, there's a nice view of uh, Cauldron Peak back there. But today we didn't come to explore this whole area. We just came to explore Pato Lake and the lookouts and show you guys everything that you guys can explore in this area. So we're going to go down to the actual river level, show you guys what that looks like. Let's get on the move. Peace out everyone. Well, it's cold. Cold and glacier fed. And we're right on the actual south delta of Pato Lake. And it's got that turquoise till color that you'll find in a lot of the mountain lakes here in the Canadian Rockies. Uh, Moraine Lake also has this crazy turquoise color and what kind of sucks is that from the ground level, you really can't see the colors very well because of the reflection of the sun. It just all looks kind of like whitish, but then at a certain angle, you'll see it properly. So we hiked all the way down here, probably a good 200 to 300 meters of elevation uh, lost, not gain. So we're gonna have to hike all the way back up there. It seems like there's a bunch of different hikes that you could do from here. There's this cauldron peak that's back in here. And then I'm looking at the ridges here and some of them have snow, but it looks fairly easy to get up top of that mountain on the side there. And then I'm looking at another one right in front of me there that has a big scree slide that goes around the corner. I think that's one of the routes they take to get up to cauldron. So you go around that loop and then over in. 
and then I see more trails at the far, far back in there, completely covered in snow. So we're lucky that we were able to get here so early in the season because it's only June 20th. So it's basically springtime just started in the mountains, basically. So I'm gonna try to show you guys a cool panoramic shot there of this whole valley here. I'm gonna show that to you guys right now. Time for go for a hike. See you guys down there. And this is Pedo Lake. It's super pretty. And I'm Eric Chablay. These are my adventures. Peace out.